Hi. I have a book here called What Do You Say When a Monkey Acts That Way? It's a book about manners and it is written by Jane Belk Mancure. Moncure, sorry. And the pictures are by Terry Super. This is another book that Miss uh, Nicole shared with us. Thank you, Miss Nicole, for sharing all of these books. This is um, part of a series, so you can get more books um, from this thing, the Magic Castle. Here's a monkey. Do you see the monkey? On Monday, little monkey made mud pies. Look at all the mud pies. He made lots and lots of mud pies. When it was time for lunch, little monkey ran to the table with mud pie hands. Oh, that's not a good idea. What did mommy monkey say? Wash your hands before you eat, little monkey. We need to keep our hands clean, right? And he did. He's a good obeyer. He washed his hands. That was on Monday. On Tuesday, little monkey pushed his sister on the swing. <gasps> he pushed too high and she fell out. Ow! What did mama monkey say? Tell your sister you are sorry, little monkey. When we do things to hurt people, even on accident, we need to work to make it right and make sure that we can stay friends and be trustworthy. So he did, he obeyed. He said, I am sorry. You see how he gave her a hug? He gave his sister a hug. That was on Tuesday. On Wednesday, Mama Monkey made spaghetti with cheese for lunch. Do you like spaghetti? Mmm. Little Monkey said, give me more spaghetti with cheese. What did Mama Monkey say? Please say please, she said. And he did. He said, please, may I have more spaghetti with cheese? That's a much nicer way to ask, isn't it? That was on Wednesday. On Thursday, Little Monkey had a birthday party. Each friend gave him a birthday gift. Hooray, said Little Monkey. Look at all my birthday gifts. What did Mama say? Little monkey, you forgot to say something. What do you say when you get something nice? So little monkey said, thank you. That was on Thursday. When we say thank you, we show that the people are important and that we are thankful. We're happy about it. On Friday, Little Monkey played with his kite. His sister said, may I have a turn? No, said Little Monkey. This is my kite. What did Mama say? Please give your sister a turn. And he did. That was on Friday. At first, he didn't feel like sharing. But Mom remembered to ask him so nicely. And he trusts his mommy and he tried it her way. How is sister feeling? She's happy. On Saturday, little monkey dumped all of his toys out of his toy box. He played with his toys and then he <gasps> ran outside. What did mommy monkey say? Please put your toys away. They need to go in the box. And he did. That was on Saturday. On Sunday, Little Monkey went to see Grandpa and Grandma Monkey. He gave each of them a big hug. What a big monkey, said Grandma. Did you get to see your Grandma and Grandpa? They gave Little Monkey a new truck. Thank you, said Little Monkey. He didn't need to be reminded this time. He knew what to do. What a big monkey, said Grandpa. Grandpa took Little Monkey to see his new sailboat. Wow. Please, may I go for a ride? Asked Little Monkey. He remembered to say please. He asked so nicely. He's good at learning. 
You can help me sail my boat, said Grandpa Monkey. Look at them both sailing. And Little Monkey did. When it was time to go home, Little Monkey said, I had a nice time. Thank you. Grandma gave him a cupcake. Yum. When Little Monkey got home, he gave his sister half the cupcake. He's sharing. Guess what Mama Monkey said? My, what a big monkey you are today. Sometimes we just have great days where we get it all right. We don't need the reminders. Here are some special words that Little Monkey learned. You can read them. Let's share. I am sorry. Please. Thank you. Those are such kind words, wonderful ways, ways that we can treat people kindly. I'll talk with you later. Bye.